huh? Hey, man. Man, what? What's man? wrong with you, man? I mean, this is a big time for us, and you want to start all these problems man, now? Man, what problems? Come get it together, dog, man. Hey, look, this is an opportunity that can blow up all of us, especially you yeah, yeah, starting your drum school and all of that. I was going to do that anyway, with or without this gig. So what, this is just a waste of your time or something? Man, if it was, I wouldn't be here, man. Man, actions speak louder than words, brother. And right now, your actions is telling me you got something look, else bro, on your look, mind. Look, bro, let me do me, man. That's all you do is you, man. You don't never worry about nobody else. Try that for a change. Man, God worry about everybody else. Come at me with no God stuff, dog. Cause you ain't even about that life. Oh yeah? What life you about? Living day after day in a box? In a box. I live in a box. Well, you know what? I live in that box. But you know what? That box that I'm living in is covered by the blood of Jesus. And I'm <laughs> fine with that. Oh yeah, yeah. So that makes you better than me? No, it don't make me better than you. But it does mean that I'm blessed enough to know that he died for my sins. And that's a privilege that you've been taking for granted. Oh, taking for granted, huh? You seem to know all about that, being the pastor's son. Skip, man, let me tell you one thing, dawg. Hey, I'm a man before anything, so I ain't finna be sitting here letting you insult me. And you can walk with the devil if you want to, but I'm gonna walk by faith and not by sight. And you keep on living this life you living. God gonna leave a sour taste in your mouth, dawg. Man, get off me, man.